What is up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Retro Hoop Collectibles. Um, this has been an overwhelmingly busy week for me personally at work, so I have been away. I haven't had much of a chance to jump on, make videos. However, uh, I did do my uh, weekly update, so I figured I'd get kind of caught up on the goings on over the last couple of weeks or the last couple of days I act like i've been away for so long um but a lot has happened since then so um before we jump into any of that before we jump into any of that um i don't ask for this often i don't ask for you guys to do this often but um if you could if you're not already please consider subscribing i do at least three videos a week one of those includes my weekly PSA update of how many cards PSA graded the week before. Uh, if you have cards that are like myself uh, have uh, stuck in PSA purgatory, we do an update on that every week. And then just generally I put out content about the hobby. Um, and, uh, you know, I think you guys should subscribe if you uh, if you enjoy watching. So uh, please do so if you haven't already hit the subscribe button. Also, follow me on Instagram at Retro Hoop Breaks. Uh, I'm going to try to get a little bit more uh, active there. Um, but if you could do that, that would help out immensely. Uh, PSA, I already did a video on PSA uh, returning with uh, with the regular service. Um, but at the time that I did that video, it was really just um, the uh, group submitters that were going to be able to submit um, at that rate. <laughs> <clears throat> and so it wasn't really that big, you know, big of a deal because honestly, you know, in order to get there, you had to go through a group submitter. You weren't be able, you wouldn't have been able to do it yourself. But just yesterday, PSA put out this update on their Instagram, on their official Instagram, and it says we are pleased to confirm that PSA regular service will reopen this month. This month being December. Uh, with a return with the return of regular we are also introducing new submission management process that will allow us to monitor demand we are testing this process with regular in preparation for eventual returns of value and lower tier uh, and the lower priced services uh, service levels in 2022 uh, let's see what's the other one say specifically the first phase will involve virtual queuing events Regular submissions will be priced at $100 per card with a limited number of allocations awarded in each event. As we advance the submission allocation system, we will continue to fine-tune pricing options and allocation levels. To take part in these events, you'll need to have an active account at psacard.com. Please visit the site and register now. If you do not have a PSA account, you can learn more about the process on our blog. So let's go there. PSA card. Uh, they just acquired card ladder. I don't care. TCG, we don't care. Where is, oh, they said the blog, right? PSA blog. Why do they make it so hard to find this kind of stuff? <laughs> so what's curious about that, two things. Obviously, the good thing is, is they're going to have the queuing system. Listen, before I even get into like whether or not this is a good thing or a bad thing, let's not gloss over the fact that they have millions of cards in their backlog at the moment from people who have been waiting almost a year, if not more than a year, if not coming up on a year, um, that have not been serviced yet. People are still waiting on their cards, and yet they're going to open up more submission slots. Please do not take anything I'm going to say from this point forward as any indication that I'm happy about what PSA is doing with opening these new service levels. However, I do feel like um, an obligation to those of you who maybe aren't waiting on PSA. Uh, you somehow got lucky and you don't have cards sitting at PSA and you're thinking about submitting to PSA for the first time, which I would highly advise against. But that's another thing. I'm not here to to deter you if that's what you're dead set on. Um, and I'm just kind of reporting the news at this point. But please make no mistake and rest assured that I am highly pissed off at the fact that they're going for this massive money grab uh, in spite of the fact that there are thousands upon thousands of us that are waiting on cards uh, that have been there for almost a year, if not more than a year, if not coming up on a year. So uh, just side note there. This, 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 is piss, this pisses me off to all hell, but 
the fact of the matter is is that it is what it is and and this is what they're doing so uh going forward they're going to do a queue system if you're familiar with the way that hga had a queue system back when they only had a couple hundred cards or a couple thousand allocations and uh people there i mean they were pretty much selling out in one day um i don't know if they're going to be doing it like that uh but you know we'll see we'll see kind of how the the mechanics of it all work um we are pleased to confirm the real with regular services. We are introducing a management regular submissions priced at a hundred. They take events. Please visit, please visit the site and register. Now I have an account with them. Oh, create your free account. That was going to be my question. I didn't know if you were going to have to create like a, a PSA club membership account, or if you could just do it with the regular account. And you can open up a free account. So there's no cost to you to open up this account and be part of these allocation events or these uh, um, uh, virtual queuing events, as they're calling them. Uh, so that's a good thing there. I like the idea, the fact that they're queuing up. Um, so that's a, you know, that's a good thing. Uh I, as I've told several of you before, I come from like the, from the sneaker culture, so I'm familiar with the process of, uh, you know, queuing up for things. Uh, today is Saturday uh, the 11th, um, so I did queue up this morning for my um, Jordan 11, uh, my gray Jordan 11s, my uh, cool gray Jordan 11s, and I did hit. So hey, I'm having a good day today. Um, but uh, so. That's cool. I think they have um, it, it's a step in the right direction in their capacity management and their sales order and their order management, which, in my opinion, uh, shows uh, that they know they have a problem. and They're trying to fix it. So that's a good thing. Uh, still sucks that several of us are waiting on cards, but it is what it is uh, going forward. That is a good thing. Um, you know, and, and it's ultimately going to allow them to continue to burn through. Uh, the backlog and then still be able to service uh, new customers um, and then you know obviously charge 10x uh, what they would have been charging for you know cards uh, before this whole fiasco took place um, so I mean there's some good things to it you know uh, and again as they mentioned what this is is that this is in preparation for them um, you know to set up the way that they're going to do things whenever they open up uh, the lower priced services uh ps listen for those of you that have and are sitting on cards that you just refuse to send anywhere else psa is fully aware of this and they want to make sure that they get your money as soon as possible um so they're going to do what they got to do to try to open things back up and get things kicked off again but the fact of the matter is is that um i just still think it's a kick in the nuts a slap in the face to those of us who have been waiting on cards uh, you know, for a, a, what I feel is an excessive amount of time, an egregiously excessive amount of time, uh, to wait for any service, especially one um, that isn't as involved as grading a card. And when I say involved, I'm saying it's not like they have to like build something or do something or grow something or, uh, you know, it, it's any, it's not anything like that. They're literally looking at a card, they're evaluating it, and that doesn't take very long. Um, but you know, to wait a year for anything is just stupid. So um, anyway, uh, it's a little bit more official now. This whole release of the uh, of, of regular services, it's a little more efficient, uh, a little more official on what they're going to be doing going forward. Obviously, they're going to be looking to bring in more services next year so they can rake in some more money. Um, and there's a handful of you that are sitting, waiting in the wings and sitting on cards that you're hoping you're going to be able to send back to PSA for five dollars or ten dollars a card, which um, I don't see that happening anytime soon. But um, if you are like me and you're waiting on cards and they've been sitting at PSA for over a year now, how do you feel about this? Does this piss you off as much as it pisses me off? Are you okay with it? Do you care about it? Are you going to be submitting any cards for a hundred bucks a card? Um, and sitting in this queue, uh, I don't know. Do you feel like this is fair? Do you feel like it's going to be fair? And do you feel like maybe... Um, like those of us, uh, in the sneaker game have experienced bots and stuff like that kind of taking over the slots. Uh, I wonder if we'll see like this, uh, you know, this idea of, um, you know, PSA being able, you know, like you being able to flip a slot, you know what I mean? Like you're sitting in the queue, you get an allocation for a $100 card submission, and then maybe you sell it to your buddy for a hundred bucks. I don't know. I, I just, I, 
I just don't like this whole queuing system. Sometimes it can be really bad. I, I understand what they're doing and trying to uh, curb everything, but you know, there's just always there's always stuff like that with you know bots and things. So I don't know. What are your thoughts? Let me know down in the comments. Um, and uh, we'll catch you guys on the next video. We'll probably do a what's today Saturday tomorrow Sunday. I'll probably live stream for a little bit. So if you get a chance, check that out. Um, yeah, that's it. Love you guys. Peace.